Hello, welcome back to Changi Chong Place in the Gungeon. Let's go with our least favorite character, the Convict here. Alright, check in here again. Mailbox, sure. Mailbox is a really fun gun. You don't normally shoot letters, and then the final shot will be a package with random effects. So, let's wait until we get it. Now, last time we went to level 4, that's really good. We're still waiting until today we're clear level 4 and go to level 5. Let's see how things go. So there's already an item room there, but we'll go the long way. Okay, so now, last time we confused the convict's starting weapon with the hunter's convict, uh, the hunter's, not hunter's convict, the hun hunter's starting weapon. So now, that's got the least amount of bullets in the gun. Five instead of the second lowest six, which makes it my least favorite choice of starting weapon. Although it's obvious fact that it's to balance out um, the sort of that the convict start with as well, and also the the portrait, where when you take damage you get a you get a short term damage increase. That's perfect demonstrating demonstration over there to see what kind what kind of um, damage increase it looks like. Okay, we'll keep going here. Now still I got a beast more turn on. I last time we didn't see much of a difference really. Things didn't get harder. It is possible it's just a gimmick. Look at the game's pattern. They, they tend to make a bit of a joke about everything. Games and stuff. Now there's a chest here but I don't want to open that one yet. Since they are rarity level between different looking chests, so I'll go the other one. Maybe I'll get the the big couch looking one or the big black office chair looking one. So if that's the case, now definitely open the big one instead of the whatever the color that one is. That's what's wrong already. I'll go the other way. Now with 22 coins, so we are basically very likely. To go to to get to 25 points to buy a key. Okay, should have walked there. Damage up over there, make things a bit easier. As much as I don't want to. Five shots really just you know, pissing me off there. Okay, there we go. Ooh, didn't see there's two more there. You sort of make use of our the damage increase. So that's one reason I still don't like the config here, because I don't I don't know how to play. I try to be offensive, try to be defensive, none of them seem to be working here. Get blank, will give us a chest over here. Active reload. It's one of the item that seem to be useful but in fact I would say not really unless I'm, I'm, I'm up to a point where my timing is so good I don't need to look at the reloading bar to get the active reloading bonus see once I don't look at it I don't get it all right here we go But I'm um, saying that if I can make good use of that, that would be pretty sweet. Because even if I fail, it would just be that normal reloading time. There's no um, penalty. I'm more than happy to shoot this one and open the other one. Let's try for secret rooms. Uh, yeah, I'll go back and open the chest. Why did I shoot the chest? I got two keys. Oh, you silly. Okay, that that's definitely stupid for not checking. All right, so we we'll go we we'll go explore a bit and see if we'll die at the boss. It's very likely. Who knows? All right, and then we'll wait for reinforcements. No. That's a bit rare. Okay, so we're done. Uh, 
Oh, we didn't even check the shop. That's where the, that is. Okay, so there's a med kit that I can't buy. There's blanks and armor. You know, I'm not gonna buy anything. If I make it out of life, maybe. We we'll go use our Gungeon Ant. Um, except it's not that useful against Bullet King. Because it's immune to fire damage. And in fact, we just blocked our, our own space. I've got one blank, so feel free to use it when you need to, but be careful. Right, this sort of mid to close range seem to be working okay. Step half, use that over there, because I know I can't dodge that. Or maybe I can. Oh, there we go. Threaded a needle, take it by the face. Alright, so we've been warmed up. Now, let's be serious. Uh, I was joke. No, I don't know how it's going to turn out the second time, but we'll keep going. Alright, start again. I've never seen that room before. There we go. Okay, that was a good, good explosions there. Uh, up there. Now again, I want to see what what other interesting gun the game has to offer. <laughs> We've been seeing some really good guns, like you know. Um, prototype railgun, also saw t-shirt cannon. I think it's just a bit more gimmick and give you a laugh, but yeah, that's pretty much it. I wish the gun sort of did a bit more, a little bit more than just that. Okay. And then we have snowballer, a gun that I, I've never really liked, but every day I want to use it, it's good. It also freezes enemies. Alright, so we've got some guns here, some supplies that I'm not interested in yet. And we'll keep pushing. Alright, so we do the same thing, just look at the rarity of the chest. It's brown, then I probably won't open it now. I always have a feeling that um, secret room is connected to the treasure room, that's why I always check that over there. Uh, nothing here. I want to check over here too. No, oh, no cracks. Oh, maybe over there? Neither. You? Nope. Okay, so we'll backtrack a bit. Go the other way. Oh. Still one damage, but then we get an extra blank. Now I'm, I'm just um, using a mouse, so I'm tap firing over there using the revolver, so the fire shot actually just got unloaded quite quickly. That's one way to make it a bit more powerful. Uh, okay, so we reached there ready. We still got one chest to open. Now we can buy a second key if we want to. Okay, got a big room here first. I never noticed the door actually stares at you. <laughs> it's cute. Okay, there we go. Uh, yep, of course it's small. Better, that's better. It's a ghost. Which reminds me of the Proton backpack. It's pretty dope. Alright. Ooh, don't get hit there. You down. Dodge a triangle. Very nice. Let's go back the other way. That leading to the chest. The birds have rather low health, which is like, okay, and you, it's very likely that you kill them before 
they puke out the egg. Alright, so scenes two chest are brown chest then. There's no no need to discriminate them. Uh yeah, that's okay. I'll go here. I'll buy that key. Cause I think more supply is better for a boss fight. Alright, so there we go. Mail gun. Speaking of the mailbox. So you can see on the icon here, these are the letters, and then when you hit the final shot, that's the parcel. Special delivery. Okay. Skeleton gal at um, a, a good map. There you go, parcel. Oh, looks like I didn't hit. Where you've where been? Okay. The it itself doesn't do a whole lot of damage, but I think the whole the whole charm of the gun is to shoot the parcel. So that was glitter, I think. So you can see how sparkly it is. Oh, it was like the easiest combination to get um, flawless, and I messed it up. And while using guns like this with the with a big finale, you don't want to reload too much because the whole point of the gun is the last shot. Let me reload early. Then you're just making the gun less powerful. Oh, okay. There you go. I was about to say it sounds funny when the gun shoots out of the ladder, but then I realized I never heard of the sound when someone shoots a ladder out of a mailbox. Okay, we're almost there. Okay, that's a poison shot. That's good. You are down. Took some damage there, not too much. And we get a health container anyway. That's good. And then we keep moving on to this second level. It takes about like 11-12 minutes for the first floor. A bit longer than I would expect it. Level 2 is check what you need. The parts. Uh, you need 3 blanks. I'll give it to you. And then you ask for more stuff. Okay. I give the 3 blanks to the blue man because it's less, it is quite rare for me to have 3 blanks after a boss. And I think one, once you unlocked whatever it does, then it's, it's permanent. So I think it's worth it to give it to, to it. Like, shoot that thing. That would take out the yeah, take out the one they're giving buff. We use a sword off here. The starting weapon just be too slow. Watch that one. Good. Uh, shop. Okay, uh, Mr. Jellyfish, what do you sell? Make a thousand stuff that I might not need. Um, there's one key, that's good to know. And hopefully, I don't need to buy it. Although the chances are slim. Aye. Stick on one armor. That's okay. Ooh, that's not very okay. Nope, that's not okay. Ha, huh, the bullet just bounces off and kill the other one over there. Come on. Okay, things are getting easier now. Go, go that way, because it looks like that leads to a chest. 
can't believe I made it just there. Ooh. Uh, should I push it down? Looks like chess is the other way because the boss is over here. Uh, let's not go there first. In case I get some good guns. Push them. No, don't push them. There we go. Okay, we've got one blank pack. That's like pretty amazing. Make a boss fight a little bit easier, hopefully. Does it look this war there? Secret room? Nope, just texture. Okay, there we go. Pretty amazing, just um, unloaded two shots over there before he shoots the crap out of me. So, green chest is the rare ones. Rarer ones. Okay. Okay, so I can see the chest uh, breathing over there. There's like two of them breathing. And then I need a key for them. Okay, so at least that uh, I get items when I kill both of them. It might take some time. Can't miss that. I don't want to go in the room and just fight him like that. It might just trigger the second one. Aggro the second one. Save the parcel, make sure the parcel hits. Yeah! Dying yet? Okay, the chest, <laughs> the other chest exploded and it got junk out of it. It looks like the rat is taking it. Here, take my junk. That sounds extremely dirty. Oh, okay, now we got both of them. Oh, okay. I swear the chest was blinking. One down, this table tech. That's a good table tech. When you see that face over there, it's a good table tech. Okay, when are you dying? I've got no blanks, yo. Okay. I've got meat bun, so I can use it. Um, there we go. For one health. Uh, we still don't have a key. Yeah, we'll go buy a key. That was such a... Such a secret room. So let's hope we get something that's worth the fight. It looks like... I don't know. I don't know how to... I don't know how to judge this weapon. It seems powerful, but the knockback and the range just a little... Seems like using a short burst like that is the way to go. Seems like it. There we go. And the damage after the table tech flip. I mean the table tech rage. Just so good. And by the way, it, it um, gives you a damage increase. After you flip the table. And then we got a blank back. I keep throwing the game. And the game just keep throwing the, me back into the game. Ooh. That was very dramatic. Dramatic is the word I want to use. Okay, you're not breathing is good. Uh, we need two keys to get over there. That's very annoying. Just more junk. Um, uh, we head here. I think we got the boss with him. Yeah. So we go fight the boss soon. I wonder if I can use this use this gun against the boss effectively. Okay. Maybe not. I'm willing to try though. That looks like just a connection room, as expected. So go here. Uh double check of guns. Okay, we still got a mailbox, it's good. And Wakanda. He took damage there, but but look at his health. It just, it just go burn through it. Okay, this, that's 
despite it's looking very dangerous, it's fun. Okay, we kill the one of the joints. That's not for good. Good, we kill the joint so he doesn't get the buff or in the health. Also, it got the buff anyway. Okay, we kill it. We just kill it. So it's a really dangerous weapon to use. It might not be something for us to use on itself. And we've got an M1 here. M1 is really a good gun. Um, piercing and a good fire rate as well. And we don't have a key. Or do we have a cell key? Because we bought the key. That's annoying. Like, very annoying. Look at the health. 31, 34. Hmm. Is there any way I can do it? Unless I can sell stuff. Which in this case is not possible. No. Uh what a pity. We'll go down to the second floor. I mean the fifth floor. Alright. So for the next floor, we'll use the M. Should we use the M1 or use the alien thing? I think I would I would save the M1 for any other users. Because I, I don't I don't see myself using the alien en engine. Hold on, is it what I call? Alien engine, yes. Oh uh, ammo. Mm, mailbox. Okay. It gives us good it gives us like what we should be also we are we're also escaping. Except that one failed. So it seemed like a pretty pretty solid strategy. There's an enemy, now we run away. Okay, and the key is good. Now instead of trying to get to the next level make progress, I'm actually having fun here just trying to shoot people and then sliding away. So wait for them to shoot. And then you shoot them. I don't know. It just it just It's just fun. I've never seen a gun to work like that. Although I know I picked this gun up before. Okay. So we don't have to worry about it for now. Just have fun. And then we'll worry about it when we just run out of ammo or we die. But then when we die, there's nothing to worry about. Okay, we'll swap the weapon for the small stuff. Ooh, okay. Yeah, that's really, really fun. Uh, got a key. I do. Yeah, open it. It's a it's a shotgun mark. So inclu increase movement speed. Normally is a really good thing because I find the character too slow. But now we have the alien engine. Can't tell if it's as useful. Okay. Wow. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, that works out. Although not really. So in that room I should have just swapped another gun instead of going close to a sniper. Oh my goodness. Right, things are looking dangerous now. If not, if it hasn't been. Definitely not using this gun. In a room like that. Reload first. Okay. So you can see it really like um, having the trail after shooting. Kill it before it blinks away. Cool. Uh, yep, this is fine. 
Yep. Okay. Oh, you've got a really good shotgun here. It's a big iron. I can't afford to buy health because I need them. And we'll proceed here. It's so much of fun that I, I, I want to buy ammo for the alien engine. It's just fun. Oh, I can destroy the rocks. If I can find the boss room, I will do it. Using M1 so I don't get too close to the bubbles. Okay. <laughs> it's ammo. Yeah, we'll give it an the engine. It ju it just show shows it um, how much of a fun that I'm having. Get hit by something over there. Is it poison? The damage is really, really high. We're the third level, and we're just killing the little bit of shot burst. And we get health back. What more can I ask for? The dodge. Over there. Okay. We take damage while on the train. That's something you take notice. I'm doing it just because um, that's an achievement for killing 100 enemies while you're on the train of the cart. Okay. Not s not that worth it. Go sleep a table, maintain damage, and more ammo. This time we give it to the M1. I didn't give it to the um, sort of because I'm a C. How I want to use it. I mean, if I ever do, it'll be after the the other guns. You dying it? I'll help you. We should be at the boss room anytime soon. Ooh. And it's a time where I don't have a key because I used it just then. I don't remember shop having a key. I must have bought it. No, I bought a heart. Alright. Now go to boss fight. And then maybe come back if we are alive. Okay. Show me the boss. Okay, it's Trenon. Now I don't know how I'm gonna use the alien engine. Hey, he's on fire. What happened? No, definitely not that. Ooh. As much as I want to use the alien engine there, I just don't think it's a good idea. Kill the small ones. That's like a very high chance that they'll kill me, causing the trend not to kill me like that okay again like I said even though I died it has so much fun in that run with the alien engine so if we get something something that can protect us let's say let of uh, the board of iron skin or something like that the activified and we give you invincibility for a short period of time that with alien engine would be marvelous but yeah anyway we'll end this here thank you for watching we'll see you next time goodbye